Hi Internet, this is Peter from Russian Machine Never Breaks. I need a haircut. I was hoping that you and I could have a quick chat about Tom Wilson. Tom Wilson is a 19-year-old forward for the Washington Capitals drafted in 2012. He is 6 foot 4 and 220 pounds. He's a big dude. He is slated to be the Capitals' next power forward, although the idea of a power forward is something of a myth in the modern NHL. At the beginning of the season, the Washington Capitals had a choice to make. They could take Tom Wilson back to Plymouth, where he would play for the Whalers and be the biggest and best player on the ice, or they could play him in the NHL, where they'd have to burn off a year of his entry-level contract. Ultimately, George McPhee decided that the best place for Wilson would be at the NHL level and not Plymouth, so here he must stay, and a year of his entry-level contract will be burned off. Here is Tom Wilson's stat line through nine games. Goals, zero. Assists, zero. Shots on goal, nine. For comparison's sake, the notoriously puck-shy Carl Alsner has 14 shots on goal through nine games. Those statistics don't necessarily mean that Tom Wilson's a bad player by any means, but they do mean that he hasn't contributed anything to the score yet. A possible explanation for all those zeros is the lack of ice time that Wilson's seen so far. He's been getting about six to nine minutes per game, the least among any regular forward for the Capitals, particularly at even strength when the score is close. That said, when Wilson is on the ice, he leads all his teammates in shot attempt differential. That means that more pucks are going towards the opponent's net than the Capitals' net. Although Wilson's competition has been among the weakest on the team. So yeah, Wilson's not generating points yet, but he is doing good things for the puck. Numbers like that are pretty encouraging. Eventually, Wilson will start scoring, but he's not being put on the ice to score. It seems like he's being put on the ice to fight. Wilson leads the team in fighting majors with three. According to HockeyFights.com, Wilson won two of those three fights, and the third one was a draw. I admit that I know nothing about fighting. I've been in two fights my entire life. One of them was over a candy cane in the seventh grade, and because I got the candy cane, I'm pretty sure that I won. Second fight was at a costume party in college. I dressed up like a nerd. A fight broke out. I was helping this girl get out of the middle of the fight, and a guy punched me in the head, and everyone screamed, don't punch the nerd! So yeah, that's not really a great sample, and I don't consider myself an expert at all, but I have yet to see any evidence that fighting leads to winning in the NHL. Fighting is like hockey's version of the underpants stealing gnomes from South Park. No one really knows how stealing underpants leads to profit, but everyone believes it anyway. A player that does nothing but fight is a goon, and I think Tom Wilson is far too talented to be a goon. So if Tom Wilson's gonna be here, let's see what he can do. Let's see him in the top six. Let's see him with some real teammates. Let's see him have an opportunity to score. Right now, the Capitals are playing untested teams in Alberta, Canada. There is no better time to get experimental than right now. Maybe give him a shot in the power play. I don't know. I just don't want to see a promising rookie play six minutes of hockey game, get into one fight a week, and call it a season. So when I call Wilson Saicho Tom, I'm not disparaging him. I'm disparaging the way he's being used so far. Because frankly, we know nothing about him as a player. We have anecdotes and sensations. It's like the time he checked three dudes. But those don't tell us anything. They're not repeatable. They're just grand moments that look cool in a gif. If we look closer at those moments themselves, they're not even really true. When he checked those three guys, he only hit one of them. The other two tripped over each other. One of them actually got hurt. It wasn't cool. Maybe Tom Wilson's a great player. Maybe he's a washout. So far, we have no idea. And we're not going to find that out until he gets some real ice time. Those are my thoughts. I would like to hear yours. Please share them. Is Tom Wilson a goon? Is Tom Wilson a true power forward? Is there such a thing as a power forward? Is fighting a waste of time? And how cute is Georgia? Crash the net.